Hi everyone, I just wanted to show you a quick way to replace fonts in a document uh, using Affinity Designer. Now this is just a one page document so it would probably be easier just to change these fonts by clicking on each one and replacing them. However, if you have a multi-page document this be, could be time consuming. So one of the ways you can do it in Affinity Designer is using the Find and Replace. To get there, you just go to Text and then Find or Control F, and it'll bring this up. Now you need to know which font, of course, that you want to replace. So first, you're going to go to the cog right here, hit Format, and you will see all the options you can change. We'll go with Font, okay, and bring your drop down menu and then look for the one that you're replacing. Okay, this is the one I used. I don't change anything else because otherwise um, it might not find it, but you can change all of this. In addition, you can also change the font size. Let's say you have a header and it's really large and you only want to change that, then you, would, you could choose the font size. We're just going to keep it there for now, then hit OK. Then you're going to do the same thing for replace. So you're going to go to the cog, format, and same thing. I already have one in there, so that's fine. Um, and you can change the font size here. Say that font's a little smaller of a font, you want to keep it large, you could change it here. So we'll keep it at 36, and then hit OK. Now just while I'm here, I just want to show you some of the other things you can do. Okay, you can change, you can actually change all this too as well. The baseline, tracking, and you can change a whole bunch of stuff in here. Variance, if they have that, if that's one of the font options, you can change that. Spacing, etc. And you can just go on. But we're just going to keep it simple and just go ahead and change it. Then you hit OK. OK, now you need to find them all. So you click Find. Of course, it found all of them. Now you can replace them one by one, like that. Or you can replace all if you want to do the entire document. And it'll change all of them. So that's it. Of course, that 36 might have been too big, so you might have to play around with that and find one that works for you. But that's basically it. Thank you.